you know, bringing a new life into the world today must be a challenge. It really must be. I've got two kids myself. I'm damn sure that other people listening to this have got children too. And babies need their very best start in life, don't they? Uh, food, shelter, warmth, love and baby formula. Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're well, let me know in the comments. Good to see you, thank you very much for the support. Very much appreciated. The numbers are continuing to go that way and it's all down to you. Thank you ever so much. Well, one thing that's going this way is the cost of baby formula, baby milk, and obviously a newborn baby or a very young infant needs a steady supply of it to be able to grow and be healthy. Well, Iceland, they're actually stepping up to the plate and doing something about the cost. And I'll read you this, see what you think. Iceland will illegally accept vouchers to help struggling families buy baby formula. Okay, that got my attention. Iceland will illegally accept discounts on baby formula from today in support of Metro and Feeds Formula for Change campaign to review the UK's archaic laws on the sale of formula powder. Richard Walker, the CEO of Iceland, says there were unintended consequences of the law which stopped retailers from applying discounts to formula milk. This has meant the price of formula has soared for years, adding to the cost of living burden on families. Now, there is actually a petition that can be signed in support of this. It's in the uh, actual news article. I leave in the link uh, in the description and uh, you'll find it in there. Even the cheapest brand has increased by 45% in the past two years. That's a hell of a jump, isn't it? Speaking on Good Morning Britain, Mr Walker said, I want to communicate a permanent price reduction. Customers can't use vouchers or loyalty points to purchase formula, but Iceland will accept them all today, even though it's illegal. This is despite a retail giant facing an unlimited fine. We've had several local authorities complain to us and Department of Health, Mr Walker says. Now, what is the formula for change? Uh, Metro and Feed calling on the government to urgently review their infant formula legislation and give retailers the green light to accept loyalty points. All food bank vouchers and store gift cards as payment for infant formula. Our aim is to take our petition to number 10 to show the Prime Minister this is an issue that can no longer be ignored. I didn't actually know this. The more signatures we get, the louder our voice. So please click here to sign our Formula for Change petition now. And again, that's in the link uh, in the description below. I mean, when, when it comes to worrying about how we're going to afford such things as baby milk there really is a problem in this country isn't there i know a lot of mothers kind of feed them the other way but uh, ultimately you need this stuff and it needs to be affordable sign a petition if you're uh, able to and or just share it if not anyway i'm off i'll see you shortly with one more Toodaloo.